forecast. Certified most accurate since 2004. The team has issued a 19 first alert weather day for overnight and into early Wednesday morning due to the threat of wintry weather. So let's time it out here. Next few hours, we're going to be quiet and dry. In some areas right now, there's barely a cloud in the sky. So we're not going to see this anytime soon. If you have evening plans, as long as they're before midnight, you should be okay. But notice that after nine on our in-house computer model here, you start to see a little bit of moisture coming in from the west. This will be a mixture of sleet, snow, rain, and freezing rain, and that's why we're concerned about slick spots overnight. So if you do To Canton and over into Youngstown. Snow belts included in this as well. So we will have some slick spots out there. This is Precision Future View. At 7 o'clock tomorrow morning, notice the pink still out there. So if you're an early morning commuter, uh, more slick spots are in our forecast. And not just for driving, but walking on any untreated surface, a sidewalk or a porch, it is going to get slick out there. Now this will all transition to rain by nine o'clock in the morning because temperatures are gonna continue to come up and the rain is out of here by midday. So we get this morning winter weather advisory and then in the afternoon, you're not gonna believe this, it will be partly sunny and highs tomorrow around 70. We wouldn't go that high if it wasn't going to be so windy, but we will have strong southerly winds tomorrow, gusting upwards of 30 miles per hour with a higher late March, almost April sun angle. And then the strong winds, we do think that we'll see a significant warm up. Some spots get stuck in the upper 60s, but hey, that's a lot better than the 30s, which is where we are right now. Unfortunately, our warm up doesn't last very long. Now, Thursday, we're seasonable, 61, but there will be rain coming through. And then Friday, oh, we're just dropping here day by day. 41 with a little wintry mix in the morning. We do warm up a little bit for the weekend, but we've got a light wintry mix on Sunday. And then looking ahead to next week, finally back in the 50s uh, by Tuesday of next week.